Hey YouTube family, I am back with another braces vlog. Um, today is November the 25th, the day before Thanksgiving. I moved up my appointment because I felt like, um, for one, I had kind of been getting a little nervous that they're going to start closing stuff. So I just figured I better move my appointment up and get over with. Um, it's only moved up like a week. It was supposed to be on December 2nd, but my appointment is today. Um, it's been almost four months since I've gotten a adjustment. Um, I haven't gotten an adjustment since the first time I got my braces put on. Last time when I came in, I did... Um, think that I was going to get a adjustment but instead she just put the appliance in my mouth and um, she didn't put on any more brackets or give me another wire so I just been having the same wire on since I got my braces put on so I felt like it was definitely time and I didn't want them to close and me go you know even longer without getting a adjustment because I would have been really upset because I want I don't want to prolong this process at all I feel like this process is going pretty fast and excuse me everything is um going pretty well I um, am loving the progress of my teeth I feel like they're moving pretty fast um it's pretty early I think I have like 15 minutes until my appointment so I just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit um I have given you updates you guys have seen the progress I'll show you up close again so I see the top of my um, jaw getting wider, definitely. I see my teeth closing even more since my last visit. Um, I'm, I'm very happy with my progress. I feel like it's going really fast, so I'm excited to get my adjustment today. Not happy that I'm getting it the day before Thanksgiving. Oh my God, that's going to be horrible. Hopefully, I won't be in too much pain, but if so, I'm just going to eat soft stuff anyway, so it won't matter, but yeah guys i um i don't know i don't have too much to say i think today i'm gonna get black as my colors and i might get like a blue on the bottom and black on the top i've definitely been wanting to try black because they say it makes your teeth look white so i'm gonna try that out i should have put this bun in on my hair because i keep on hitting my head the top of my car and i hope they don't be messing up my bun while i'm laying in this chair <laughs> okay but anyways, guys, I will see you guys when I get in here. Bye. I'm not doing that good. I feel like mm -hmm. when I talk, my tongue does not stay behind it. Um, but when I'm not talking, I do keep my tongue behind it. When I'm sleeping, I find that I wake up and my tongue is not behind it anymore. What about your habit? Oh, not doing that at all. I wasn't doing that before I got it in. But my biggest thing is I'm trying to keep my tongue back. Mm -hmm. So I feel like I do need it for a lot longer because I have not gotten down packed swallowing correctly and keeping my tongue where it's supposed to be. It just... If, if, when I talk, I sound like this when I talk with oh, my yeah, tongue yeah. behind it. And I hate that because yeah. a lot of people can't understand me. Yeah. So I was getting frustrated. I don't think you need to do that when you're talking. Okay, perfect. It's only like swallowing. Yes. So when I'm swallowing, I do keep my tongue behind that's it. It, that's it still it. is a task. I yeah. It's really hard for me, yeah. but I've been working on it. Okay. It may take a while. Okay. Yeah, yeah I think it will for me. <laughs> but I've gotten used to it. It's not bad. Mm -hmm. Wow. Did you notice how much your bites closed? Mm -hmm. I have. Oh my god. I'm actually going to start you on some elastics today. Yay. Did we start you last time? No. Okay. And open for me. So today, today the goal is, you see those back second molars? Mm -hmm. Is to get those uh, brackets put on. Okay. Top and bottom and then bite down. And, oh wait, are we turning your expander for you? I turned it. You today. turned it yourself? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah, I turn it once a week, like you told me. Okay, but You know what? Maybe I'm just going to get you on some elastics today. And then I'll do the sevens next time. Because okay. I feel like she's on double or on fours already. And I don't want to open up the bind. Once you put sevens on it, it opens yeah. up the bind a little bit. So, 
Mm -hmm. Oh, we changed my wire? No, you're already on double own. So the thing is that your bite's closing nicely. Mm -hmm. Sometimes when you put the brackets on the back teeth, it tends to open up the bite a little bit. Okay. So I might just get you on the elastics first. Okay. And then, you know, uh, add the brackets next time. Okay. But you're on a nice double wire, so you're okay. Right okay. down for me? But I just want to, I want the bite closed. And that will also help you with the tongue. And your crossbite's gone. Yeah. Oh, that's amazing. It's looking great. Thank you. Do you know what colors you want? So today yeah. Today will be a nice short appointment, except for the rubber bands. Okay. I'm going to show you two ways to wear it. You can wear it whichever way you feel is easier for you. Okay. The best way, and then the some patients don't like it at all. So then I'll show you a side way. Okay. okay. Do you want this for me? Yeah, sure. Okay. Oops. And I want to try um, black at the top, but I don't know what color. I want a different color for the bottom, so. Okay, I'll show you the color. Okay. Um, okay, so I'm going to start with this one. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'll start with a little bit lighter elastic, so it's not super hard for you. Okay. I don't know why it's just clouding my vision a little bit. So I want to try maybe this blue. Okay. And then black at the top. I think we'll start with monkey. I don't want to okay. Too much. okay. So here's so here's the ideal way to do it. So if you look at your mouth, do you have a picture here? Oh, I can look at my phone, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> you see this hook right here? Uh-huh. And this hook right here. Uh-huh. And then this hook right here and this hook right here. Uh -huh. So by down, so our goal is to close this bite right here, okay? Mm -hmm. So it's gonna go on this hook to this hook. And it's, it may be a little uncomfortable for you. Mm -hmm. So this is the ideal way to do it. Okay. Just like a square on all the first hooks that you see. Now, if you feel that it's not comfortable, mm -hmm. then I'll show you another way to do it, which is which also works pretty good. And that's, it, that's it wasn't bad. That's exact. Okay. You can do either or. So you see these, these hooks back there? Mm -hmm. So you're just gonna start on either top or bottom. So. You can start on top like this, see that? Mm -hmm. Then you go under here. You go from here, and you do zigzag. So that's like a zigzag. Okay. So you can do either that square. Mm -hmm. Sometimes patients feel like it hurts their gums a little bit, and it's too uncomfortable. Then you can just do a zigzag on either side. Okay. So I'm gonna change the colors real quick. I'm gonna have other change the colors and then I want you to practice and see, make sure you can get it on. And how many hours a day should I wear those? Okay. <laughs> as much as possible. Okay. Um, the only time you're supposed to take it out is when you're brushing and eating. Okay. Okay? Okay. Uh, but I'm super excited about this bite closure. I think next time if I can get a little bit more, then we'll go to the second one. Okay. Course. Sounds okay. good. Okay. Yeah. Before talking, you don't have to put your tongue at the back. You talk normally. 
just for saving. Okay. And with the tongue is in press position, it should be also behind the bar. But any other uh, of course when you speak you need to move your tongue forward okay. to pronounce properly mm -hmm. the word. So it's not supposed to stay behind the bar. Okay. practice with elastics. Okay. Which one do you prefer to practice first? The um, square one. I think that's going to be the easiest one for me. <laughs> do you prefer the light? Um, yeah. where you can see your gum like white there because mm -hmm. it's a lot of pressure okay sometimes i see patients like put this mm -hmm. i'm going to show you but don't do it it's just if you're at home and you think about this i see some patients doing like this it's more comfortable but the main idea is to lower all mm -hmm. close the bite no this and this one keep it high yeah, it doesn't do that. bother me that much right now. I know after wearing it a long time, yeah, it could. Yeah, start wearing a long time, mm -hmm. it will bother you. I'm just going to try to keep like, the lower you can. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm going to wear it like this, but I can try the other way. Yes, yeah, let's try the other way just in case. Okay. Like this? Yes, now both sides, you're going to go under the lower hook. Let's say this one, the premolar, and that one, both sides, the other side also. No, I mean in, this, in that hook. Mm -hmm. so let me show you how. Hold this. That way you can at home just remember. Okay. Okay. Right now, what? Which? One, do you prefer to go home? The both sides or the theater one? Both sides, just so I can try that one since I know I can do the other one. You want to, uh, do you want, I do it or do you do it? You can do it. Okay. <laughs> okay, and I hope I can do it. There are 200. Okay. Should you have to go with, uh, wear both sides at the same time? You have 100 days. Okay. Next appointment is 60, so you have more than enough. So okay. you have to try to wear it all day long and change it for new ones every night before going to sleep. Okay. That way, when the elastic are right now, really strong, you're sleeping, so you're not going to feel too much. Okay. Next morning, it's going to be a little bit loose. You're going to speak and everything a little bit better okay. at night. I'm changing 24, 24 hours okay. every night. If one uh, broke during the day, don't worry. It's start at the end of the day. Okay. And I can show you. Let me. Yes. All right, y'all. So I got my rubber bands in, and oh my god. Rubber bands is not no joke at all. Like, these hurt already. I can't talk. And I just got them in. And I got to keep them in for a long time. Well, until I eat. Because I'm, I'm eat. But. And I'm happy to know. I don't have to keep my tongue behind this um, tongue crib. Unless, like, I'm swallowing. Or that's just where my tongue is supposed to sit. But it's not supposed to be there when I talk. What in the heck are you doing, sir? Why does stuff like this guy happen to me? 
people what? I'm sorry y'all it's just in my truck in front of me on some weird stuff anyway <laughs> I was a little disappointed that I still didn't get my brackets on my back teeth and another wire but she said I already have two wires at the top and the bottom and that I don't need um, that because sometimes it makes your bite open more and she's trying to close my bite before she does that so I gotta listen to my ortho it's her plan she know what she's doing so she said these these bars these bars these wires definitely have been working because my bite is closed more and more I feel like when I go back in January with these rubber bands my bite will probably be closed for sure and then I'll go ahead and get my other brackets and my another wire so yeah I'm about to go get my nails done y'all and then I gotta run some other one errands I'm really not trying to be out that much because it's the day before Thanksgiving and like stuff is probably super packed and I don't like being nowhere where it's super packed right now especially with coronavirus so I called my nail place and they said they're they're wide open right now for appointments so that is where I am about to go but I'm trying to think if I'm missing anything to tell y'all that she told me I don't remember <laughs> I don't know these were beds is tripping me out and the way that I'm talking is horrible like telling y'all rubber bands is not no joke y'all this is probably about to get painful but i heard too like the more you talk the better because it's like pulling on your teeth i'm spitting slobbering everywhere and i feel like this is gonna be hard for me to do probably not but i like the one that was like this better because it would seem like it'd be easier and easier for me to talk because this is retarded like i sound stupid <laughs> but when it's done i sound stupid <laughs> i'm funny y'all <laughs> anyways i'm gonna see y'all in the next vlog like i said i'm about to go get my nails done i'll see you guys later i love you guys thank you for all of the views on my last video it's like over 8k I just wish that y'all would subscribe and stop playing with me because like I only have 162 subscribers like help help me out y'all I um I know y'all want to see this beautiful smile journey quit playing like subscribe to my YouTube channel like thank you for watching my vlogs but if you don't subscribe you a hater <laughs> but no I love all y'all thank you for my subscribers and I really appreciate anyone who clicks on my video and watches it Thank you so much, you guys. And have a happy Thanksgiving. Mwah!